Hello YouTube. It is time to feed my pet snake. Okay, let me get this cover off first. Okay. Okay, what I do is I get I get a pinky rat, soak it in there for about 10 minutes, and then take it out of the bag, because I leave it in the bag, and then check to make sure everything is thawed out. Then I feed it to my snake. Let's get this started. There we go. It strikes at it almost immediately. As you can see, the corn snakes actually eat their food pretty fast. He's almost halfway done. And if you didn't know, their jaws can open way bigger than they look. Yep. And what I have in the cage is a toilet paper roll, just so he, sometimes he goes in there to hide, you know, before he eats. And the reason there's no bedding in there is because one time I fed him and that bedding got caught with his food so I had to take it out and they just get caught in his, in with the rat and it'd go down in him but I would try to take it out before he would choke on it or anything. And there he is finishing up the V10 tail. And if you're wondering, I have the zoom on, so that's why it looks like he's so big and so close, which I'm pretty much about two to three inches away from him, believe it or not. There we go, swallowing the feet. There he goes, he is done with the snake and just probably swallowing it now. And as you can see, there's a big lump in his stomach compared to everything else, which will take him about two days, or it took him two days to swallow the rat all the way down and poop it out. And yeah, that's pretty much it. And then after this, I leave him in there for a while so he could get the food in him and down it so I could pick him up and bring him back to his back to his aquarium. So yeah. Comment, rate, subscribe. Thank you guys very much. See you later.